I'm looking for something. I am missing something because I'm sitting on it. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So it's been a hot minute since I've talked to you guys or I've uploaded a video. It's been a really, really long time. But I've really missed YouTube and I've really missed making content for y'all. So I decided to jump back into it and I figured I would start with a haul. So I have like a little mini haul from Walmart that I wanted to share with you guys. I'm really excited about some of the things that I picked up. Um, I know Walmart isn't really the typical place that people do hauls from, but you never know what you're gonna find from Walmart, like honestly. So, we're just gonna jump right into the haul. Anyway, so I got these really cute brush sets from Echo Tools. These are what they look like. These are so freaking cute. They were both $16.88, $17 a piece about. So we'll talk about this one first. This is their crystal finish for a crystal clear finish. They have jade infused bristles and they are literally so cute. They have this marble finish on the handles and they also come with this really cute um crystal bracelet. That's like the biggest reason why I wanted these sets because they come with accessories. So, but it comes with a angled foundation brush, a full coverage concealer brush, and a buffing bronzer brush. And they're just so cute. Like, I just, I just love them. They're so cute. So I'm super excited to try these. And then we also have the glossy finish set. So this is to create a luminous look, again, with the jade infused bristles, which I think is a really interesting touch. I really love crystals and I'm really starting to get into them and learn about them so these just really piqued my interest this set comes with two crystal hairpins which just was really excited about so this set comes with a micro blending brush a super a super a sheer finish blush brush and a sculpt and highlight brush so i'm super excited about these so excited it's upside down whoops so excited. I love them so much. They are so freaking cute. Cannot wait to use them. If you are interested in how they perform, then I can definitely do like a get ready with me using them or something like that. I'll figure it out. But if you are interested in seeing how they work or whatever, leave a comment down below. So moving on to more beauty tools, I guess. I did pick up a few eyebrow tools because... I desperately needed them. So the first thing that I picked up was this set by Japanesque. I did open this already. So this is not what it looks like. I could not get the packaging right when I put it back together. I needed the scissors for something. I can't remember. So I pulled the scissors out, but now couldn't get the package back together to show y'all. So, but anyway, this is from Japanesque. It comes with, it comes with the scissors two tweezers and there's a spoolie behind those tweezers but I couldn't get the packaging back together so but anyway it does come with the tweezers the spoolie and the scissors so literally in this ten dollar set you can get everything that you absolutely need to create the like the most amazing brows of your life so I picked these up because I needed some new tweezers but I also got this personal hair trimmer it comes with a battery, which is amazing. I love when products do that just because, like, I don't have to worry about going out and picking up more batteries. It's already there provided for you. It comes with this hair. What is this? A dual-length eyebrow trimming attachment, which I think is pretty cool. I've had something like this before. I've never used this. I don't know how to use this. Never used it. But I really like this because it has two blades so on this side it has the long blade and then on this side it has like a little micro blade so you can really get in there and shape your brows the way that you want them I absolutely love this I had another one but it was by a different brand and that one pooped out on me so hopefully this one will be better this is by Equate um but yeah this is by Equate this was ten dollars as well so for 20 bucks you literally have everything Although you really could just do with this, but I'm a little extra and I wanted the brow trimmer. I don't know. So I got those and then I did pick up a few makeup products. 
not a lot just a few things that I needed or was interested in buying I'm looking for something I am missing something because I'm sitting on it <laughs> okay so keeping on with the eyes I did pick out a new eyebrow pencil this is by wet n wild the retractable brow pencil I got this in the color ash brown I have had this before I loved it when I had it before it was amazing um, it has an angled tip and a spoolie so you really can get like in there and fill in your eyebrows and make them the shape that you want whatever what have you but I really like this and this is only three dollars you guys so it's super amazing for the price I do recommend moving on to the face I got a new primer this is by Maybelline this is the baby skin um, instant pore eraser. I really do like this. I liked it when it first came out, but I totally forgot about it like completely. And then I saw it on TikTok or something and I was like, oh my God, I forgot about how much I liked that. So I picked it up again. Still really do like it. It does have a very silicone feel. So if you don't like that, then I would not suggest for you, but I do like this a lot. $8. I think it's like seven something. And then I did pick up three different foundations. We'll start with Maybelline because, yeah. So this is the Maybelline Dream BB Fresh Cream with the pomegranate extract. This is an 8-in-1 beauty balm and it has SPF 30, which is amazing. It's perfect for like your everyday makeup, like when you're not like really like going full face and you just want something light. And it protects your skin, which is super, super important. Like, you need to make sure that you're wearing sunscreen and protecting your skin. Oh, my cat is driving me crazy. You can't see him. He's on my bed. Just, uh. And then I had to pick up another one of the Photo Ready Candid um, Revlon. I don't know what I'm trying to say here. The Photo Ready Candid Revlon. What am I saying? The Revlon Photo Ready Candid foundation this is in the color 400 macadamia absolutely love this foundation you guys it is so amazing i am in love this is one of my ride or die foundations for sure love this foundation it is so worth the price it is so so good i love it and it's only like eight bucks i think it might be nine but i'm not sure it's literally it's in between seven and seven and nine so it's it's really good i recommend Try it if you haven't yet because it's so good. And because I love this one, I had to pick up their new Candid Glow because, oh, that one was so great. This one has to be good too, right? Who knows? I'm so excited to try it. I was disappointed about the color range that this um, collection has just because this one has such a nice wide selection of colors. This one does not. This one has like maybe a third of the colors that this one has so that was really disappointing so I ended up going with the 270 medium beige hopefully this will work for me we'll see but I'm really excited about these two definitely pick this one up if you haven't because it's so good so the next couple products that I have gotten are for my hair I'm really excited about them I've never heard of either of these brands and I was really excited to try something new so the first thing I got was these new shampoo and conditioner. These are by Glow and Habit. These are moisturizing conditioner and shampoos. They are supposed to hydrate and nourish your hair. They are free from sulfates, parabens, pathlates, mineral oils, silicones, gluten, soy, synthetic colors, and more. They are also vegan and not tested on animals, which is amazing. I am so excited about these. They smell amazing as well green apple so good I got the apple aloe and kiwi juice but they smell so good so I'm really excited about these hopefully they will make my hair smell like a fresh juicy green apple that was weird I'm sorry about that ignore that comment that I just said so along to go along with those I also got the grow girl restoration serum this is for damaged hair and split ends so I like to wear my hair I don't really like to wear my hair but I tend to wear my hair in buns a lot just and that puts a lot of stress on my hair and I also straighten it a lot so all that heat damage I wanted something that was going to help with that and hopefully this will do the trick but if 
any of you have tried anything from Grow Girl or Grow and Habit, then let me know in the comments down below if you liked their products or if you didn't like their products because I've never heard of them. So. so I did pick up a few like beauty health related things, like two beauty health related things. So the first thing I got was the Ollie or Oli vitamins. These are the woman's multivitamin. It has A, C, D, E, B's, biotin, and folic acid. You get 90 gummies and I have taken these already. They are so good. They literally taste like candy. They are so delicious. The best like tasting vitamin gummies that I've had. So yum. So good. Um, the next thing beauty health related thing that I got this I was really intrigued by this is beauty collagen water um, it has zero GMO gluten sweeteners and colors um, it's supposed to help with your skin hair and nails and it has 5,000 milligrams of collagen this is actually in clearance it was $3 and I was like well it's three bucks why not try it it was really interesting to me this is by the brand Har Harmony Proteins yeah harmony proteins it comes with six packets and you literally just put it in like a 16 ounce glass of water or a water bottle and you shake it up and you drink it my mom has tried them already and she says that it doesn't really have a taste but it more like the aftertaste is kind of like green apple so that's kind of interesting to me i have not tried them yet but i'm kind of excited so there are those the last two things that i'm super excited to show you are bigger items like furniture pieces that I found at Walmart that I'm super excited about. The first thing that I wanted to show you guys is this amazing egg chair that I am sitting in right now. I love it. I will flip you guys around so you can get the full experience but it's so amazing. It's so like deep. It's in my bedroom right now because I really wanted like a secluded space to like read and journal and just plan my days out and yeah, I do have some twinkle lights that I also got from Walmart, actually. They were $5 a piece. But I do have some twinkle lights on here. They are not enough. I don't like the way that it looks right now. I won't, I'm going to get some longer ones to, like, string throughout. So, like, I have the lights everywhere. But this, the $5 ones only came with, like, 36 LEDs. But, I mean, it was $5. So, what can you do? But yeah, I love this chair, so I'm going to turn you guys around so you can see the full, beautiful experience of it. So, here we go. Alright, here is the chair. I love it so much. It is so freaking cute. I have the, tw the twinkle lights on the sides, but as you can see, there was just not enough of them. I did not anticipate how big my chair was. Like, I wasn't anticipating that when I bought them. But it is so cute. I got this at Walmart for $2.97. And then that pillow, this pillow right here is actually from TJ Maxx. That was like $20. But it does come with all the cream pillows that you see. It is so cute. So amazing. I love it so much. So excited about this. This is literally a dupe for the Opal House chair at Target. That one's like $400. And... This one is literally $100 less. And it is so cute. I love it so much. So moving on to the very last thing that I got from Walmart. I'm so excited about it. So we'll jump right on over to that. Here's my vanity. Got it from Walmart. Love this vanity. It is so, so cute. I love the like whatever you want to call this, like the spiral detail around the mirror. I actually thought I was going to hate it and I bought a different mirror to sit on top of it and it just looks so silly. It looks so stupid. So I actually didn't end up doing that. Love the mirror. It's this beautiful metallic champagne color. It's very like, it gives me like retro glam vibes. Like honestly, it really does. So oh, here's the mirror. It comes with this elevated like this elevated shelf and then all around the edges is this beautiful metal work it has the same kind of metal work as the mirror which is so cute it is on these hairpin legs and it also comes with a stool as well that is like this beautiful like velvet cream top 
and then the stool also has the same type of metal work detail as well and then the top as you can see is mirrored which i think just gives it like that super like glam touch this vanity actually wasn't that hard to put together until we get to putting the glass part on so if you guys can see let me just move my brushes a little bit if you can see like these little suction cup things you have to like stick them into this metal like arm i want to call it i guess like if you can see that so annoying to get in there i literally had to take like tweezers to shove those in there hence why i needed new tweezers so there you have it my vanity all right guys so that is the end of the video i hope you enjoyed the haul if you did please give this video a big fat thumbs up and comment like and subscribe y'all know the drill and i will see you guys in the next one bye guys